So the question is, how do I set up continuous arrivals in Pro Model? Here in our example model, I have it half built. We have two locations, each with, with a capacity of one. I have an entity named Shipment, and I want Shipment to arrive continuously to location one uh, and then proceed throughout the model. So we're going to set this up with an arrival. We're just going to click on the first location, which will fill out most of it. we got to change some things, though. Uh, we're going to leave this at one, so just one quantity each arrival. First time is when the model starts. The occurrence says instead of infinite, we're going to change that to one. And then frequency, we're going to delete that. And that's how you have to have your arrival set up to make it work properly. Uh, you then go into the processing logic, and in the record that goes from location one to location two, we're going to add some move logic. Uh, we're going to say move for 10 minutes. Uh, and I'll explain later why we're going to put that in. But then the important step, we're going to order one shipment to location one. Now, the reason we have a move statement is because if there were no move statement, this statement orders a new entity as soon as the, uh, the prior entity starts to flow down the model. And so you can see we would get backed up very quickly. So the move for 10 minutes simply staggers that. So you need to apply a wait time according to what your model dictates. Another important thing to note, the arrival location uh, has to have a capacity of one. So those are the couple things you have to have. An arrival record where the frequency is left blank and you have one occurrence and one quantity each and then you have to order in the, order in the entity uh, in the move logic moving from the arriving location. And that's how you set up continuous flow and pro model.